Stephen A., our Adrian Wojnarowski is reporting that the Nets are not entertaining trade offers for James Harden as we approach the trade deadline. I think that's a mistake. He's averaging 28, 23, 10, and 8. Shoot 42% from the field, about 33% from three point range. Those numbers are down. We understand what difficulty he's had to work with because Kyrie's there part time, KD's injured, et cetera, et cetera. I think it's safe to say that Brooklyn is not all it was cracked up to be in James Harden's mind right now. He's making $44 million this year, has a player option to make $47 million next year. He may opt out to go elsewhere. And if he chooses to do that, you could end up getting nothing. Not to say that's going to happen, but you could. Why would you take that chance when he still has so much value? What you do to me is you listen to everything. You don't move them necessarily, but you listen to everything. You don't just not take phone calls and you're not listening and you're not entertaining anything when you have such a tremendous asset who may not want to be there come summertime. You keep it for this summer, you keep it for this season, but I, don't, I think you take all phone calls because you never know what somebody might be willing to offer you for James Harden. But they have a chance to win it this year. I understand that. So you keep them this year, but you can listen to the phone calls. You don't know what you'll get offered. You never know. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.